Hi, my beautiful people. How are you doing? My name is Ndidi. Yes, so today I want to emphasize on the um I want to emphasize on 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 CS. Yes. The reason why I want to emphasize on on cesarean section this afternoon is because um, I myself I, I'm a mother of three beautiful children. Yes, uh, two girls and one boy, and I had three of my children through CS. So whatever I am saying here, yeah, I am saying it. Out of my own experience so guys um it has come to my notice that um nigerian women or will i say nigerians yes some of nigerians they see caesarean section known as cs as an abomination thing they see it as a taboo they see it as a bad omen they see it as a no-no you know, if somebody hears that um, you have your child through CS, they'll be like, God forbid, me, I will not have my child through CS. God forbid. What's that? What's that? What is wrong with having a child through CS? What is wrong with having a child through CS? I remember the last time I traveled to my village, I was discussing with um, somebody in the village. So... I don't know as our uh, uh, conversation uh, uh, continues. So, in fact, I don't know what prompted it. So, I now told her that I, I had three of my children through CS. As soon as I said it, you need to see the way this woman quickly covered my mouth that I shouldn't say it again. I was like, what is wrong? What is the problem? Is there anything wrong with having a child? She said, she said please, I should not say it uh, where people will hear it, so that people will not hear it. I said, but what, what, is there anything wrong with that? She said that it looks somehow and the fact that, is that, that I should not say it where people will hear it. Please, in fact, I should not even mention it again. I was like, what? What? What is going on? And apart from that, sometimes, because I have friends, I've been in the midst of women, you know, Maybe they are, you know, women that like when they are um, discussing, you know, they are normal uh, gossip, gossiping. Uh, you see, some people they will say, God forbid, though, I will not have my child through CS. What is, what is wrong with having your child through CS? Um, I, I'm in one group in Facebook. So the group has to do with women thing. So I'm only seeing people uh, uh, posting a, 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 a a prayer request that people should help them include them in their prayer that they are pregnant they will soon put to bed that their doc doctor said that they are going to have their child through CS that they, they don't want to have their child through CS what is wrong with having your child through CS if I may ask what is wrong with having your child through CS whether you have your child through vagina or you have your child through CS betting is betting what is wrong with it so, um, uh, what is wrong with it? There's nothing wrong with having your child through CS. And even this, our so-called um, religious leaders, they, don't even, they are not even of helping matter. I remember when I, I had my, my, my first child, I think my, uh, the pregnancy was about seven months old. So I went to the hospital. So, you know, during the... Uh, uh, during the time of examining the position of the baby, they discovered that my baby was bridged. So my gynecologist now told me that I should just get prepared, that I might be lucky before I enter nine months, that the baby position might change, that if the baby position did not change, that I should have it in mind that I will go for CS. You know, that was my, my, my first pregnancy. I have no idea. So I was so, so scared, you know. So... I now told one of my sister about it. She's not, not really my biological sister. She, um, 
you have in fact you related somehow and she's the kind of person that she jumped from all this uh, prophetic church to another so when i told her she now said her that uh, she will take me to one of her prophets she will pray for me that the, the man will pray for me that by the time the man finished praying for me that the baby position will, will, will change and she knows that me i'm the kind of person that i don't believe in all these uh, prophets because i know there are many fake prophets out there so i don't even go to them I don't go to them. I only rely on going to my church. I pray to my God because those prophets, they don't have, they have one head just like me. It's the same God that created them, that creates me. So if they can pray, God will answer them. Me too, I will pray, that God will answer me. So I don't have to go and visit any, any man of God to pray for me. In fact, I don't go to them. She knows, she even said it that uh, she knows that I might not agree to follow her. So at the end of the day, she convinced me and I followed her. So when I got to the so-called man of God, so I was expecting the man of God, you know, to start uh, 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 prophesizing to me, sister, this is what brought, brought you to my place. He didn't. What he did is to start asking me what's the problem. So after I finished explaining to him, he now started praying that I should. In fact, he was like trying to put fear in me so that I will not go, so that I will come and give him money. That I should not even try to go for that sales. That if I go there, I will not come out alive. I will die. Blah, 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 blah. I should bring money to come and sow seed so that they will come to my house and hold the VG and pray. Everything will be normal. So. I said, okay, there's no problem. Right inside my mind, I don't want to do it. So I left. When my husband came back, I told my husband, I know the kind of husband I have, because my husband, the father uh, was, a, uh, because the father is late. When the father was alive, the father was a reverend church in El Pacho. So they brought them up in a, in a godly way. So he knows, he knows the Bible very well. So he was like that I should not even make a mistake of bringing that man into our house. So at the end of the day, I went for that for for that series. What happened to me? Nothing. Look at me today. I have three of my children. After that one, I have to space and wait. After after like three years or four years, I took him for my for my second child. After my second child, I think I waited for like um I think I waited for like five years or more than five years. Because me, I like to space. I like to, you know, allow my body to heal, rest before I will take it. I don't want, I'm a, when I'm about to come out from, you know, to take care of babies is not easy. I will jump into another one. No, I don't want that kind of a, a thing. So, I, so I, I always space. I space. And in fact, people will be like, Madam, what are you waiting for? Now, this year, your mother is too much. Oh, just do this thing once and for all. My dear, there is no rush in this life. You have to take your time and do your thing. So I always take my time to do my things. I, whatever I want to do, it, I do it at my own con convenient time. So my the second one i think i would I, I waited for like five years before i took him for my for my third child so here i am today i am healthy my children are healthy we are okay we are doing great so why would somebody come and you know try to put fear in you or say you should not go for cs does does giving birth through cs make you a less woman does it make you a weak woman my dear there's nothing wrong with cs this series of a thing saves life at least this year now has made the uh, the immortality in, in, in childbearing to reduce. You know, the way uh, women used to die in childbearing before, I think it is less now. Because before, you see a woman that her child is bridged, you know, they know then she will not try to give birth through vagina drift, uh, delivery. At the end of the day, she will keep pushing, 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 you know. After, maybe at the end of the day, she will die. Her baby will die. She will not be alive. So does it make sense? There's nothing wrong with sex. So my people, if you see me, because I have some, some things that are jotted down, down. So if you see me glancing through my um, jotting, please, I hope you will not take it to be anything. I, I'm not a medical person, so I have to put down some of my this, uh, uh, some of the things uh, down so that I will not forget it. So guys, um. Uh, um, uh, what is uh, this? Uh, if I may ask, uh, if I may ask, what is cesarean section? Cesarean section is known as CS or a cesarean delivery. It is out of giving birth through surgical procedure by which a baby is delivered through an insection in the 
mother's abdomen often performed because vaginal delivery will put the baby or the mother at risk you see because there are so many factors you know that could lead to cs you know when uh, factors in fact there are many but i'm going to mention few here factors like bridge bridge presentation fatal distress multiple uh, multiple pre, uh, pregnancy premature rupture um uh, if the mother is weak okay or if the blood pressure of, of of that person is high you know or if the person is uh, 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 is not uh, 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 is not having a contraction or if the person is not uh, dilating very well like in my own case my first child was bridge okay my first child was was bridge and already at home you know before i think before uh, your water will break you have already started experiencing labor in my own case there's nothing like labor i did not experience any labor no contraction no dilating no nothing just like that and my baby is, is is due to come out because i was at home when my water broke you see in that situation how am i going to deliver the child of course they have to carry us here to bring out the child okay my second child I was also at home, my water broke. No contraction, no dilating, no labor, no, no nothing. The same thing with, with my third child. So there are a lot of things that could lead to this CS. Okay, there are a lot, it's better for them to carry out this CS for you women, please, you guys should not see CS as, as a bad woman. You guys should not see CS as a bad thing. There's nothing wrong with CS. It's better for you to be alive, take care of your child, you know, than for you to try to, maybe you go to hospital, doctor, doctor, because I know a lot of women, they are like that. I've heard so many stories. When a doctor told them that they will have their child through CS, they will not start jumping from one man of God to another, you know, or they will go to, they will go, uh, they will go and meet all these uh, women that they do home delivery. At the end of the day, they will die. Or maybe they will develop uh, uh, complication. They will not rush them to the hospital. Before you know it, it is too late. The person will die. It doesn't make sense. There's nothing wrong with CS. Before the doctor will tell you that he will carry out a CS on you, they, 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 there is something that they see that is not right. Okay? They don't want to put your life and your baby's life at risk. That's why they want to carry out the CS. There's nothing wrong with CS. There's nothing wrong with CS. If the doctor said they will carry out CS, just Maybe there's nothing wrong with before you know it it doesn't take time your baby is out before you know it the only thing that normally take time is the uh, 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 incision that normally take time before you know it you're out of the theater just give yourself some time you know your wound will heal you be okay you'll be fine so there's nothing wrong with it even if you want to deliver through vaginal delivery you will still feel pains there are I've, I've seen women in labor. It's as if, in fact, when you see them, you become scared. So there's nothing wrong with giving a, a, a birth through CS. I, I'm a living testimony. I have three, three of my children through CS. Like the only thing I don't like about uh, giving birth through CS is maybe at the end of the day your tummy might not be able to because that's the problem most women are having you know you cannot compare yourself to a woman that deliver delivered normally you know the woman will have the opportunity to start working on her tummy or to start using guido or whatever you know to make sure her tummy goes back but you that you give birth to through CS, you will not have that opportunity. You have to allow your body to heal. That, like me, I, I need, I used to give myself time. I will allow my body after. I usually breastfeed my children one year and three months. I do exclusive after uh, exclusive. I will introduce food for them and I will continue breastfeeding them to even though they have started working. I don't care. But all my children, I breastfeeded them a year and three good months. After that, then I will not start working on my weight. I will, I, will, I will place myself on diet, I will eat no carbs, you know, I will do exercise before you know it. Like if you see me, you won't believe that uh, people, my friends, they will be like, are you sure you give birth uh, uh, to your three children? She says, how come your tummy is very flat? I have a very flat tummy because I work for it. Just, you just work for it, you'll be fine and you'll be good. So women, I plead with you guys, please, there's nothing wrong with, 
uh, having a child through CS. Don't see it as a taboo. Don't see it as an abomination. Don't see it as a, a bad woman. There's nothing wrong with it. Please, at least this CS now is saving life. Women does not die in childbearing the way they used to die. Please, save your life. Okay, guys, so I think I've ranted the... Uh, 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 enough on this issue. So, guys, um, I think I'll come to the end of this video. Bye. See you in my next video. Bye. Let me take my water bag. I'm so thirsty. My my um, throat is dried.